In this video, we'll write the Lewis structure for BrCl5. This is bromine pentachloride. So for bromine pentachloride to write the Lewis structure, we need to count up the valence electrons. Bromine, that's in group 17, sometimes called 7A. That has seven valence electrons. Plus chlorine, that's in the same group. So that'll have seven, and we have five chlorine atoms. So we're going to multiply that by five. That'll give us a total of 42 valence electrons for the BrCl5 Lewis structure. I've already put the bonds between the chlorine atoms and then that central bromine. So we've used 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. 10 valence electrons. We have 32 left. Note that bromine, that has 10 valence electrons around it. That's okay though. Bromine, it can have an expanded octet, more than 8. So we're good there. Next, let's complete the octets around each chlorine atom. At this point, we've used a total of 40 valence electrons. We have each chlorine with an octet. The bromine, we said that can have an expanded octet. But we have 42, so we still have two valence electrons, and we need to put them somewhere. Makes the most sense to just put them on the central bromine here. So we'll just put them right here on the bromine. And again, the bromine can have an expanded octet. So it has more than eight, but it's able to do that. So we've drawn the Lewis structure for BrCl5. We've used all 42 valence electrons. All the chlorines, they have octets. The central bromine, that has an octet as well. If we would check the formal charges for each atom here, we'd find that they'd be zero. So that means that this is the best or most likely Lewis structure for BrCl5. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.